Hey everybody, and welcome back to another episode of The Outer Worlds. So in this episode, I am going towards the secret lab that, um... That thing crashed a lot. I can't remember what company it was for now. Uh, Sublight, that's the one. Uh, yeah. Gonna call them in Cascadia on Monarch and, uh... Yeah, I'm just heading towards the secret lab they told me about. Some kind of special gas is there or whatever. And this is basically a ghost town. Ah, oh, damn, I do love that revolver. This is the type of gun I want in most games, but very few of them have this kind of gun. It's always shitty little revolvers as well. Snub nose revolvers. Like, I, I never had this type of gun in Fallout, which is where I wanted it most. Especially New Vegas. Alright, anyone up here? Hello? Surprise! Oh, I missed. Oh, I hit him. Okay, I just alerted the whole town, but fuck it. I got rid of two of them. What is this, a till? A till's got money. 21, that's not much. Like, upgrades cost somewhere near a thousand. Ah, oh, and they're both down. Burn, bitches! I made short work of them. I need to sell some of these guns, man. I'm gonna be over encumbered soon. Or encumbered. Is it encumbered or over encumbered in this? I have to go there anyway, what am I doing? Ah, oh, I cannot use this while in combat. Right, where is... Where are the other people I'm fighting? Over there. Man, I can't even see him. Get him? Yeah. I'm going to need to Google this game just to see where I can get some good armor from. Because I want, I want a set of armor I'm going to like the look of. That makes me look like a badass, and then just sort of... That I can they sort of stick with for the rest of the game. Alright. Supervisor override. Password antediluvian. Ooh, what's this? Nothing in there. Probably shouldn't be grabbing things out of a bin anyway. Alright, and down. Transition to Rezo. I can read that. Rezo Secret Lab, let's say.
Okay, I'll do this. Uh, go back to Catherine and sort that out. Um, and sort out the Slaughterhouse Clive quest I did. Then I need to do Neoka's quest. Because that's apparently on the way to the main quest location. That information broker I have to go see. Rizzo's Purple Berry Punch. This is Rizzo's lab, all right. Place has more dust than sweetener now. It's cool that if they put a helmet on them, they do they, the voice does change. That's a nice little touch. Okay, where am I going? In here? Oh, 75. Jesus. All right, so clearly I have to go around. Unless I put all my points leveling up, like, to this point, into hacking. Proximity alert. Biology human. Protocol kill all plants. Suspended. Present your Rizzo identification credentials or prepare to be downsized. The disengage security protocols. I am not a threat. Attempting to disengage security protocols without proper authorization is a fireable offense. Priming weapons. Oh, you bitch. I am an authorized Rizzo employee. Password antediluvian. Executive level password accepted. As identification according to employee ID protocol A-3501. Welcome back. Doctor, be advised. Mantisaur threat level is petrifying purple berry. Please use caution. Mantisaur wounds are not covered under Rizzo's health policy. Have a productive day. Cool. Good to know. So I can just grab this and leave, yeah? Uh, I can't read that. It's too dark. Do I go through here now? No. What? Oh, I have to go through the other door, do I? Is, is if there is another door, I didn't didn't really check. Yeah, there is. Cool. It's barred. And that is too. Okay, cool. Joy. These pricks again. Good here. Nope, that's too much. And that's that, there yeah. We go. As perfectly aligned as the plan itself. Ah, oh, there's another fucking room I have to go into. Whoa. Keep missing.
Alright, you guys mop up. Ugh, I don't get slaughtered, please. What's happening right now? I'm getting damaged. Mop by it. I hope this fire thing goes out soon. Yeah. This is the part where I take over, Captain. Do not fret. I've been cracking systems like these for years. Well, can't be any harder than understanding scientism, right? <laughs> I do so love when you jest with me. I will take that as an intended distraction from the stress of all that could go terribly and excruciatingly wrong should I fail. Yeah, you do that. Aha! Got it. Easy as mock apple pie. Not too shabby, preacher man. You can say that again. Except for the last part. Do not call me that. On pain of death. Uh, <laughs> huh. I'd like to see you try and stop me. Alright, so he doesn't like being called Preacher Man. Alright, that wasn't too bad, actually. That was pretty straightforward, getting in there. Didn't have to do anything. Okay, my family did call me, but uh, seems to have gone quiet now. Yeah, that's right. You better run, bitch. Oh, it's coming back. Ah, well, you know that anatomy, those anatomy infographic things do come in handy. Where am I going now? Ah, oh, I'm still, I'm still running around this area. Okay, okay. Need to get to the ship, I imagine. Maybe. Incoming. Hey, there's my ship. So do I board said ship? Hey, you guys, stop playing with the local wildlife. Oh my god. Get away from me, you little shit. Alright, I'm getting on the ship. 
screw with that. Against all odds, the unreliable takes flight. Yeah, I thought this would change. This little loading screen would change into something else the further into the game I got, but apparently it doesn't. It just stays like this. That being said, though, um, bringing back the uh, what are they called, you know, the the um, colonists. That's like yeah, colonists is good word as any. Back to Edgewater did give me a loading, a different loading screen. So I'm assuming the next big thing I do in the game will have like an extra, will add an extra loading screen Our or fuel whatever. Our cells are now primed with Alta Vitae gas. As the organics say, let us hope we do not explode in transit to the Groundbreaker. Wait, I have to go back to the Groundbreaker. Alright, so I'm leaving that on the side there. Uh, Alright, I'm going to go back to Fallbrook and then do Nyoka's quest. Uh, yeah, maybe not. Maybe not there, because that's where all the... Uh, Monsters are they were trying to kill me just now. So go here. Fallbrook, there you go. We're now in orbit above Fallbrook, Captain. Good. Neoka, I'll leave Vicar Max there, because he hasn't got anything to do with this at the moment. And yeah, I'll take Ellie with me. It's always good to have a medic on board, I guess. I'll finish this quest, go do Nyokas, and then carry on with the main one. And then, at the, after I finish the main quest, I might go back to the main, uh, the first town I go about, I went to, Stella Bay, and uh, do that uh, quest where that guy asked me to see where his poster is. Because, you know, XP is XP. Yeah, in between, in between this episode and the next one, I might actually do that. I might uh, do a quick Google search for any cool bits of armor. That way then I can just collect them as I go along. Because it costs quite a bit to upgrade armor in this. I don't want to be spending a shit ton of my money on different pieces of armor that I keep changing throughout the game, you know? Please say the Yoda corpse you're wearing is Clive's. Slaughterhouse Clive is deceased. Huh. Not much boast to that declaration. Am I to take that to mean you didn't kill him? They they say discretion is a virtue. You ain't wrong, but I prefer a man of vice myself. Still, this ought to compensate for your troubles. And take an aromatic. You stink like Sisty Pig. Alright, well, that's enough for now. See you around, Catherine. Yeah, bitch. Alright, what's next? Ooh, level up. Level up! Uh, persuade. Oh, long guns as well. Um, hack. Yeah, yeah, sure. And then two into leadership. Why am I not wearing a helmet? Heavy. Yeah, I don't really want a heavy armor. Um, I'm kind of happy with this outfit, really.
No, what am I doing? Journal or uh, upgrade. Grave with New Yorker. Where is this one? Okay, just fast travel here. Go visit the grave and see whatever the next part of the quest is, and if it's not on this planet, or if I need to go somewhere else, because I remember her, she said that she needed... I needed to go to the grave first, and then go and see the other two remaining people that were in her team. Hopefully they're not on this planet. So I can just carry on with the main quest then in the next episode. Or in this one, depending on how long this takes me. Alright, where am I going? Where am I going? There we are. Wraps. Let's clear this sulfur sodden fucks out so Hayes can rest in peace. Ah, oh, yeah. God, I love this gun. It's brilliant. Yeah, I'm really getting into this game now. Now that I've got ammo and a decent level. Buried beneath the surface of Hayes' grave is a small lockbox. Its hinges rusted through and its wood almost completely rotted. It nearly falls apart in your hands. But in it, you have managed to find a tarnished silver medallion bearing the letters Sharon. This mean anything to you? Hayes was the best self-sacrificing son of a saint I ever met. Halcyon is worse off without him. Now, if we're gonna lure the Manta Queen out, we'll need to find Rebecca and Anders. They took a UDL contract on Terra too. We never heard from them again. Think it's time I call in a favor with Hiram. If anyone can track them down, it's him. Hold on, tell me about the UDL contract. I don't know much about it. It paid well, so they took it. They said they'd be back in a couple of weeks, and that maybe we could all use the money to get off Monarch. That was a long time ago. You didn't try and find them? I should have. I... I really should have. But soon after they left, Hayes and the others died. And to be honest, after him, I... I stopped trying. Because it hurt like hell to do so. Well, for what it's worth, I'm glad you're trying to confront it. Thanks. I'm still not convinced I won't come to regret it, but we've started down this path. Might as well see it through. Maybe it'll stop me screaming at night. Now come on, let's make tracks before Hiram dies of old age. Yep, well, it's good enough for me. Let's, uh, where is, where are we going? Uh, is it really? Is That's where we're going? What? Ah. Uh, it was there the entire time. I say that like I could have gone to him sooner, but I couldn't because I was doing all that other, like, a shit ton of other quests, so. And I needed, I needed to do this one before I went to go and see him. Because, yeah, she. I, I basically figure, <laughs> I basically guessed. You know, which wasn't hard. I need to do this quest, you know, because it would take me there. Because she did say to do, to do this, to her quest prior to go seeing him. Risky choke points, all the things I hate about mountains. It is a trek, isn't it? Almost like we don't have working lifts or roads. 
Oh my god, I have to go down there, do I? Why did I come up here? Alright, run back down the mountain. The Devil's Peak Canyons. Okay, so no idea what to expect now. I mean, when when she said the play, like, the guy lives in a place called Devil's Peak, I was expecting the top of a mountain, not a cavern. Look up that makeshift bridge. We gotta cross it. First, we go under, then hook around to the left, then up and over. Whoa! No way. Yeah. Bitch. That's the last of them. Well, that was fun. I didn't do much in that fight, but it was fun. And I'm over incumbent now, aren't I? Yeah. Shit. Uh. Break down some of these. Alright, that'll do. Here we go. Don't mess with us. Tunnel here. around to the left or go in gun blazing up to you okay let's try and uh, sneak past this thing the hell look up what's he doing up there okay Don't know who that guy is, don't recognize the name. Probably not gonna find out either. Because scene transition. Oh well, I'm sure he was doing something fun and interesting. Which is not what I want in my walkthrough. I want this to be boring and uneventful. So I'll probably go back at some point. Maybe. Maybe not. Yeah, if you hear any clicking noises on the commentary as well, it's probably my knuckle, like on my knuckles, but you know, my fingers, because they tend to click quite a bit when I'm holding the uh, controller. You make it in one piece. 
Station ain't too far now. Hey, you! Get over here! There are marauders up ahead! I wonder if... What the? Alright. How the hell did marauders navigate the caverns? This station's under the protection of the corporate compliance crew. You a marauder? Cause me and my sunshine, that's my gun if you were wondering, we don't take kindly to marauders. I, uh, wasn't really wondering what your gun was called, but thank you for telling me. And, uh, no, I'm not a marauder. A coherent enough response, I reckon. Must be true. You're clear, but I would caution you against pressing on ahead. This station's plumb crawling with marauders, you know. And what are you doing here exactly? Are you hunting said marauders? I take it you ain't met the other C3s. Me and Sunshine are doing exactly what we've been tasked with. You want more details? You ought to talk to my crew. They're guarding a small barracks to the southeast, by the edge of the mountain. And what are you waiting for? Care to help me maybe kill these marauders? There is nothing I'd enjoy more, but the C3s play it by the book. Usually. Go petition the boss man. Maybe you can convince him to alter my duties. Sorry, it's a uh, family knocked the door. Um, right, well, I'm going to finish this off. And, uh, yeah, I'm going to call it a day here. I um, hope you've all enjoyed the episode so far. If you would uh, like to leave a like, maybe, and hit that comment section below, um, it would all be very much appreciated, and I'd love to hear from you. Uh, also, if you wait uh, if you wait around for the end screen, you'll get two suggestions for different playlists that I've done, different walkthroughs, and uh, you can subscribe, hit the subscribe button, and that'll keep you up to date, and uh, yeah, it'll help you sort of show support, which would be very welcome, believe me. And if you hit the um, bell icon below the video, you can keep up to date with the rest of this walkthrough, which I should be releasing daily, I hope. I'm getting, th at the current time of recording this, I'm getting the first few episodes up. So, yeah, this should be up in no time at all. Thank you all for watching, and until next time, you take care.